It turns out the moon may not be made out of cheese after all. New research suggests the moon has a partially molten layer of rock just above its core. Just like the moon and sun cause tides on Earth that change the planet's shape, the Earth and sun cause tides on the moon. These are harder to spot because there's no oceans on the moon, but scientists have used data from two spacecraft to measure these tides. Data from NASA's Gravity Recovery and Interior Laboratory, or GRAIL mission, and the Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter were used to measure the periodic changes in the shape of the moon caused by the gravitational effects of the Earth and sun. Looking at the time it took to respond and recover from these forces, scientists created computer models of the interior structure of the moon, and in this case only models with a partially molten layer near the core replicated the observations. This is a super cool result, although of course it does raise new questions, such as where does the heat come from to maintain this molten layer, and how did the moon evolve to have such a layer in the first place. The paper is published in AGU Advances. That's our 60 seconds, please like and subscribe if you enjoy the content, and I'll see you back here tomorrow.